Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Swiss Buck Trekker. Now, the Swiss Buck knives are knives that were made by Winger and then imported to the U.S. by Buck Knives, and thus the Swiss Buck brand. And these are kind of interesting knives. They're usually there's a almost identical parallel knife with these but what you get is you get totally different scales you get buck branded scales and they have kind of a sort of a, a grip to them and they're not bad the other thing is they have well I'll show you they have different shaped blades like in this case you have a small clip point blade instead of the traditional, well, I'll just show you. I'll show you on a Victorinox. Instead of the traditional smaller blade, you get a clip point blade like so. Now, also, this particular one, the Trekker, in currently being made knives, the closest parallel is the Victorinox Camper. And I'll include links in the description for information on the Swiss Army Knife Wiki page for this. And I'll include a link for the camper if you want to check it out. If you want the nearest parallel with Winger, it's the Backpacker 2. I think its tools are identical for the Backpacker 2. Now, for the large blade, you have another clip point blade as compared to... Oops. As compared to the normal Swiss Army knife blade. Now the Victorinox blades, if you remember, are a little bit more flared, but they're very similar. They're not a clip point blade like this one. Now, this knife has... Can I get it out? No. There's like a little... That's one thing that's kind of interesting. The, the little thumb notches in a different place. This one has a wood saw, which is, I mean, like, these wood saws actually work pretty good. I can tell you that many years ago, with my first Swiss champ, I cut down some little bitty tiny trees. Now, this one has the aggressive and slightly evil-looking winger can opener versus the Victorinox can opener, which is the nicer and later version as opposed to the super angry version. You have the winger style bottle opener, screwdriver, and wire stripper. On the back you've got the awl, which is a winger style awl. And you've got the corkscrew, which all the times I've used a Swiss Army knife, I've never used the corkscrew to unscrew a cork. Now, this one has the winger style toothpick and tweezers. And again, the thumb notches are facing inward here versus being on the outside on the Victorinox. They follow the, the winger style. And you have kind of a little a little chain for your key ring. That's not too bad. It's actually a surprisingly interesting little knife. I I like the I like the Swiss Bucks a lot more than I was expecting to. I don't know. What do y'all think? Are the Swiss Bucks neat, interesting, cool, just sort of weird and dumb? Let me know what you think in the comments. If you're interested in picking one of these up, they're they're discontinued because, well, wingers are discontinued and a team up with Winger and Buck is like extra, extra discontinued. But they pop up on eBay every now and then and on Amazon. And I mean, like, they pop up, you know, in the box if you're so inclined. If there's anything interesting. I don't think there's anything interesting in these. I think we looked through this one before. Yeah. 
It's just the care and feeding of your Swiss Army knife. Anyway, what do y'all think? Do you like the Swiss box or not? I don't know. I like it more than I was expecting, I think. Hmm. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope y'all have an excellent day.